stop and think Why spend too much time just getting ready Let me be Good morning you guys, we are on our weekend coffee run. Grayson got flipped forward the other day. Uh, it's so cute seeing him when I look back. Um, we got the whole crew with us and Chloe and we're gonna go get some coffee. Are we gonna go to Dutch Bros or? Oh, I thought you said that. Yeah, I don't think Dutch Bros has coffee or food. I think they only have coffee. Course. We ended up going to Starbucks because the, what was it? Dutch Bros, the Dutch Bros line was way too long. It was like wrapped around. They Adam gets the, people. yeah, there's like a full on security system. <laughs> the line wraps around like three times. Adam just gets cold brew with sweet cream cold foam on top. And I'm still getting just a venti uh, vanilla latte, ice vanilla latte. I don't know why I keep getting it, but it's pretty good. Adam pulled off his breakfast sandwich this morning using the air filter. Started a trend on Instagram. How do you feel getting tagged in all these stories? It's a big deal. I uh, <laughs> like to thank all my followers for all you've done for me over this over the last couple days. favorite thing to do. He loves Chloe. I'm making the kids some lunch. They're having barbecue chicken, fruit, peas. Bailey doesn't like peas, so I gave her some grapes and a string cheese. Adam's gonna hang these up. I got these from Pottery Barn. And I'm gonna have them put them like going up across their TV. I think it'll look really cute. And then I also got them a new night light from Pottery Barn too. It's a butterfly. I'll take it out and show you guys. How cute. Where should I put this? In a plug? Under here. In an outlet? I don't know. In an outlet up here. What about this one over here? Their room is a mess. I'm going to put it right here. Oh, that's very nice. But, <laughs> that's hey, so cute. What? I get the one that's detected by its light. What do you mean? Because now you gotta either leave it on all the time or flip it on. Yeah, that's fine. I can flip it on. Like a solar one, you know? Oh my gosh, it's a nightlight, babe. <laughs> no, they make nightlights that are like powered by, like it turns on when the lights are off. Yeah, that's fine. You know what I mean? It's fine. They'll have fun turning it on. Okay, let's hang these. Thing that I haven't done to make you notice me. Let me be real here. When I see you. My heart starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But this time, this time, girl, I know what's bothering me. I need somebody to love. Oh, na 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 na. Don't you see what's I wanted to show you something. Look up. Dad and me. You like them? Yeah. They're butterflies. They're on both sides. Just down there. It looks like they're coming out of the TV. Is that cool? Yeah. We are officially moving Tatum into <laughs> into her room. Last night was her first night in here and we just had blankets like pinned up there because we're waiting on our window treatments. We're gonna do drapes and shades in here, um, but we got these temporary blackout, they're like paper ones, and they were super easy to install. Adam put that up in like two seconds. So this is gonna be her second night in her room, and this is her crib. Adam put this together last night, it's really cute. I got this from Overstock. I love it. We're just waiting on her Newton crib mattress. Um, but for the time being, she's just gonna be in her snoo without motion. And we've started um, sleep training. So this is our second night. She's officially out of our room and our room looks so bare. <laughs> Show you guys. There's like a huge spot. Oh, I actually 
I also went shopping for Adam for new clothes. <laughs> I was debating on whether or not I should show you guys like a haul, but I got everything from Target. Um, I spent like $200 when I got him, like so much stuff. We're going on a trip with Young Living um, in a couple weeks and he literally lives in the same t-shirts. Anyways, this is where she was. This news gone, it's really sad. But it feels really good to like have her in her own space. She is four and a half months now. Um, so I think I wanna do either like a sitting area right here with two chairs and like a little table or a um, kind of like a bookcase, but with doors and glass and I can style it. I don't know, let me know what you guys think I should do. And I still need to get a um, like a big olive tree for that corner. But we have so much space right here, so the possibilities are endless. But we're gonna start her bedtime routine. And that looks good. Okay, we're gonna give her a bath. This is what we use for her bath. Um, she has a handheld little thing in here, but it's so powerful. We need to change the head on this because it's way too strong for her. The one in my bathroom, in our bath, is way more gentle. But now that she's like in her room, I want her to be able to like be in her bath and have her whole routine in here. So this is what we use to bathe her. She loves bathroom. I need to get her a dresser for her room because all her stuff is still in, in ours. So I need to transfer everything over. I'm picking out some pajamas for her. I'm just gonna put her in this since she's still swaddled right now, but I ordered her the Merlin um, suit so that when that comes in, it should be here in like a couple days. We're gonna take her out of the swaddle. But I need to get her a dresser for in here. Probably put it on this wall right here and then crib, and then we're gonna do a rocking chair in this corner. I need to get her a rug in here. We'll probably get rid of that and just put her changing table on her dresser. Um, so yeah, next room I think we're gonna do is Tatum's because um, she deserves a cute little room in here, but she was in the bathroom before today during nap time because it was dark in here. So it was still really light with the the blankets hung out, but that looks really good, babe. Sweet. Now she can sleep in her room. Uh-oh. No. <laughs> on camera, too. <laughs> Turn it off. I'm gonna pull the snoo out here. Tatum's little bouncer. She's napping right now. You think she's gonna like it? Yes. Yeah. It's from Skip Hop. We got it on Amazon. It's fine. What's Skip Hop? Hmm? It's called Skip Hop. That's the brand. There's a little Can piano I, for her feet. How is it supposed to pop? I think it this needs batteries, babe. You've got some pretty good sisters, Tatum. Do you like it?
I just got out of the shower. I am about to tan. Adam and I are gonna go to Top Golf with Vanessa and JP. <coughs> Sorry, I'm tickle in my throat. Um, and I'm gonna tan using this stuff. Um, a girl I follow on Instagram, her name's Jennifer. She um, created this formula called Tan Again, and this is the first time I'm gonna try it. I ordered it last week, and it came with this mitt and an exfoliating scrub mitt that I just use in the shower. So I'll show you guys what it looks like after. I'm really excited to try it out. So here's the before of my arm. Okay, here is the after. I just finished tanning. I am very, very impressed with this formula. It goes on super smooth. And I know a lot of people will say this about tanning products, but this really does not have a scent. Like, not at all. It does not smell bad whatsoever. I'm in the bronze ultra dark shade i think she has a few shades on her website definitely get the mitt this came together as a set with the exfoliating mitt um so i'll link it below but very impressed the color is gorgeous i will say though this has nothing to do with her product by the way this is any tanning product that i use um it brings out my kp so bad it just like really accentuates it i have kp really bad on my legs it's like travel down to my calf too on both legs i have it really bad on the backs of my arms and i feel like after pregnancy it's just gotten so much worse and i've not found a product that will help it so this is why i don't really tan very often because it really shows but i love being tan but it's it's just gotten so bad i think i'm gonna start um i don't really have it very much on my arms um, i have it a little bit on this side like right there, but um, I think I'm going to try uh, laser hair removal and see if that helps because um, it's one of my biggest insecurities. Adam and I just left for a date night. We haven't been on a date night in so long. <laughs> um, we're going to Top Golf. We're meeting Vanessa and JP there. She is about to have her baby like any day now, you guys. She's actually due on my birthday on the 19th, but she always goes like weeks early. She's 38 weeks and two days now, I think. So this is the longest she's ever been pregnant, I'm pretty sure. So literally any day, I'm like, I cannot believe you're going out right now, but she's so excited. Um, this is our last like hoorah before baby gets here. I can't wait to meet her. Um, but I'm really excited to just like hang out and spend time with them. We love going out with them. They're our favorite people ever. Um, but we're stopping by, I think we're gonna do Walmart because it's like right on the way um, to get a basket because I got a bunch of goodies together for her for her new baby. So like all my favorite things I got her. I'll show you guys once I package it a lot cuter. That's why I'm going to Walmart to get like a cute basket we're and some. Um, no, I'm gonna get like tissue paper and stuff and do it myself. But I got the Halo sleep sack. Um, I got her a bun bun, some so luxury products, Wallaments products. Um, there's a bunch of goodies down there that I'll show you guys. Okay, so I found this basket for her to put everything in, but I think it's a little too big, so I need to find some tissue paper to fill the bottom with. And then I'm gonna get some ribbon to tie around it. Those are cute. Robots are taking over the world. It's like flickering on screen, the light. It is. Is it? It's so weird because it's not doing that in person. Oh, don't do it again. <laughs> That's close. YouTube vloggers, they sure love taking things out of one container and putting it in another. <laughs> <laughs> they really do. Let's take the toothpaste out of the toothpaste container and put it into another container. Yep, that's what we do. That's what you do, and you get, it's great. Ooh, okay, now I get the goods. Shove it in there for God's sakes. Yes. You really went all out, didn't you? Oh, I think 
faves. All the faves. Getting, getting drunk with all that goods in there. <laughs> oh, my arm's about to fall off. I'm even the worst. Huh? I'm the worst. <laughs> what? I'm just messing with you, babe. Okay. Oh, got that the wrapping. Yeah, gotta get that wrapping. This one. Oh, yeah. Should we just do that? Yeah, no. Don't rip that off, though. Ooh, don't? don't? Well, yeah, but don't, don't like, make a tear. <gasps> Oh, no. That's what I was scared of. Yeah. Oh, me. So there's literally a perforated line. You just gotta, you know, go along there like so. Perfect. It sparkles all over me. It's good. This isn't gonna stay, I don't think. I right know. I'll try my best. Cute.